hate to do this to you, but we're going to anyway. Because the next piece is magnificent. But you know that gentle, sweet place you're in right now? Yeah. <laughs> Those of you who are sleeping, you know, okay. We're gonna really wake you up. So we're gonna turn our ears to New York State, Rochester to be exact, to the year 2007. So we know the music's gonna sound a lot different now. Uh, this is written by Beth Boltman, and she is a young a female composer living today. She actually gave this piece of music to the orchestra because she has been so impressed with what they've done and got to know some of the individuals in the orchestra. This is called Tribal Warfare, and the story behind this is very cool. She, you know, people think, we know that jazz musicians, you know, get together and jam, and we know that uh, fiddlers get together and jam, but some people don't realize that we classical players, we can jam too. We get together and we can improvise and create new sounds. So she and a bunch of musicians were together one weekend up in New York and they in 2007 and they were improvising and it got very wonderful and very exciting. She said people broke out in singing, broke out dancing because we express ourselves in so many, so many wonderful ways as human beings. And she said someone shouted, this sounds like tribal warfare in a good way. So she took that name, and from that afternoon of that incredible energetic music making, she created this piece of music to bring that spirit together. And then she kept that extemporaneous yell that was given and gave it the title. So everybody's awake now? Because I don't want to scare anybody. It starts out gentle, but it doesn't stay that way.
Yeah. <laughs> the more we worked on it, and it's really hard, the more we really, really liked it, I think, all of us.